clever. Puts the bumper bar out in front and is tackled on the 30 metre line. A penalty Two goes to Australia. Two in a row. Jarrett's a bit slow and then you've re gripped. And Mitchell. Left foot. It looks to hook, but he got it through. Mate, Jack Whiten. Kiwis with. It's gone high and they almost came up with the ball. Munster has got it. Broke free from the tackle. Crossed the halfway. Crosses the 40. Beats another. Comes to the 30. Gets the ball back to Cook, and Cook is put to ground. Held down by Brandon Smith, and then it's to Boy, which away to Papale! Got the ball away, and Australia have got themselves, okay. I believe, a four-pointer. That will be tackle two. I have a try. It could be Jake to the ball's passed, that's got the try. It then comes off a New Zealand player. I think it's ricocheted and off Jake a, a Kiwi takes defender possession here. Cleanly and grounds it. Yeah. Here it is, no try. Out from dummy half, Smith gets it to JWH. 35 out from the line for Smith to go right side and pick up Johnson. Johnson puts a floater in and Mitchell, he might make him pay severely. He's down the flying fox and away goes Ed O'Carr. A 60 metre run for Josh to score and there he is in the try celebration. Once he gets over that advantage line, gets right into the line. Look at that, just screams intercept. That's a bad play, Rabbits. We've got our goal post to be lit up tonight. Every time there's a goal or a score, you watch here. Latrell will poke this through the middle. This is from Goal Light Technology. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so here's Jerry Evans dodging the buttons and getting it back to Vaughan. He's very annoyed. Might be the original Louis the Fly. Here's Cherry Evans away to Frizzell. He's over. Tyson's there. He will love this moment. Have a look at that. Bang. Straight in there. All new combinations on the left edge for the Kiwis. Struggling there. Freddie. You know, the two players used the same combination the set before. A little bit further out. It looked just as dangerous, but when it was done on the line here, the Kiwis had to come in, they had to jam in. Once Terry Evan gets over that line, they have to start making decisions. They're just on their heels. Benji Marshall in no position to stop. It's a big diff. back rower, no chance at all. There's Johnson and Chilvas has checked Jordan's in. Nickel Klopstad, they're heading for the line, the Kiwis. And Nickel Klopstad has taken one. Yeah, good. And also, Jack White is playing too tight. When the decoy came through, Kenny Bromwich, it just didn't give poor old Nick Cotter any opportunity at all. Have a look and just hold on, he's inside, inside, just panicking. That's most really from defending one further player in. You get more latitude as a 5'8 defending compared to centre. So you can get stripped on the outside. At 5'8, you've got two people protecting you. That bloody fly won't go away, will it? No, it's going to get us. So that might be the end of the section with only a matter of seconds for the siren and the scrum not able to pack. My half-time vow is to kill this fly. I will. And that was a good, tough 40 minutes of test football. Kangaroos, some classy moments, gives them a 12-4 lead. Kiwis hanging on, but they needed the break and they need to lift in the second half. So here's the second half. Australia is James Bray. Oh, there's a penalty from the restart. He's got a very big piece of it. Asako was good stuff. Chancy, but good. No, and a high fly from Hughes. Back for Johnson. He gets rid of it before he hits the ground. It's picked up by Hughes. Now, this is like Harlem Globetrotters. This is Manu. Manu looking for somebody. Here's another Harbour Bridge pass. Not as big a Harbour Bridge, but a a similar pass, and now it's Blair. And now coming away is Cook, and he's fast this kid. Former beat sprint champion. They're after him, but they've got no hope of catching him. And Damien Cook, he scores at the other end. What a wonderful passage of rugby league. The hot potato from the Kiwis, and then the steal from Cook. So the 
good point you're making. He's defending three in from this Western team. He doesn't have, he doesn't have to do all the hard work. The all the other fellas are doing the hard yak. Yeah. yeah, good luck. That should be defended according to Joey. Well, three of his forwards are topping the tackle count there. You can see on the bottom of the screen. Here goes Cook again with a dummy half scamper. Got it away to Tedesco. And what a combination. See, Cook and Tedesco, brilliant again. Rubber kick, Jake's with it. And then short from Papali to Cherry Evans. And oh, there's a, a green and gold jumper plunged in. Marshall's, Marshall's blown tackle. up a treat. Have a and try. Jack, or Jake sure Trebovich has got the Jake ball Trebovich under his doesn't wing. Lose it into a defender. Offloads back to Tedavano for Johnson. Johnson shows, show and go, and then gets a the ball away for Isako. And oh, good tackle, Munster. Ball goes to Addo Carr. Look out, the Fox has got the ball. Come on, out. Here's Munster. Putting a kick down there, Addo Carr's after it. But the bounce is good for Tuivasa Shek. And here's Roger. Coming back and linking up with Malmalo. And he plays it just on the 30 metre line for Harawira Naira to go to ground. And this will be, if in fact it is played, the last play the ball or the last play in front of us now with Brandon Smith. Chipping it over the top, Tedesco goes to ground. Something that he, he wouldn't like to do uh, without putting up some kind of opposition. But the Kangaroos have won this test match at uh, Wollongong, well patronised by the local people. The Kangaroos 26 have beaten the Kiwis 4.